What's up everybody? It's Titan Feet Jack and I'm back at you with another video. Before we get into today's video, I need a couple of things from you guys. I need you to hit that like button on today's video. Also leave a comment in the comment section letting me know your thoughts on the sneaker we're about to look at today and the video itself. And sub up to the channel if you haven't already and do hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I come back with another video. Now today is Saturday, April the uh, 14th and on uh, the 15th, yeah, the 15th rather, excuse me. And the Air Jordan Retro 1 Lucky Greens released today. Uh, we wanted to do some store vlogging for you guys today, but we had inclement weather in the area. So, you know, as a safety precaution, I didn't vlog when I was going around. So we're back at the spot and we're just going to discuss what happened today uh if you wanted a pair of these if you did the leg work you could have got you a pair pretty easily because these are pretty much sitting in most sizes everywhere i mean i did have an early review for these and i did have a size for the toe but i'm not so sure i'm gonna rock with these because uh i still have the OG pine greens which are behind me but uh this is what came out today and this is not based off of uh, resale popularity however it is a good quality shoe good materials but I have a shoe similar in color to this and I'm talking about the uh Nike Don't Glow the SB from the JPEG Pro Green this is pretty much the same color green so this is why when I made the early video, I was reluctant to do it on feet because I wasn't sure that I was going to rock with these, so I'm probably going to pass with these. So if you can just go to your local stores and you want these, you can get these for retail, guys. But while I was there, I also did a little shopping. I saw a couple of items on the clear. First, I went to my local Hibbit store. Uh, they had some items on sale, well actually on clearance, I had some rewards so I went on and used that, it's nice for the summertime, these little uh, knee lit, I'm sorry, knee length fit shorts, got that orange colorway, got a little trip to uh, the sunshine state coming up, might rock these there, you know, had to get the bright colors, got these as well, Line got a few pair of kicks I can rock these with and I picked this up off the clearance rack from uh Hibbit uh let's see the retail price on these was uh I don't know it's covered up on this pair let's see well they had the clearance sticker on here for $19 but they were somewhere between 10 and 15 bucks so I got both of these for uh, less than $30. So that's a win. Got that from my local Hibbit. So let's go ahead and put that up. Then I went to City Gear as well. Because I had to go there for something. And uh, City Gear and Hibbit, they're under the same umbrella. And I picked up this shirt here. Light patch on here can y'all see that color wizard blue hint hint yes if you intend on getting a Jordan wizard threes there you go you can go to your local uh, city gear and get this shirt to rock with them so when release day come there you go you'll be ready to rock and roll but uh that's what I did today guys when I went to pick up the uh, Air John Retro on Lucky Green. So let me know what the release was like in your city. And did you get the sneakers or did you not get them due to the uh, resale prices? But uh, that's the video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack. Signing out.